I'm here for you. Hey, okay, man. so we are live. Yes, yes. Nice. Welcome to Vibing in the D with Lily. Yay! Yes, yes. You are now tuned in to Vibing in the D with Lily, the podcast dedicated to the creatives of Detroit. Now let's get into this vibe session. What's up? What's up, everybody? Yes, what it do? What it do? How y'all doing yes, tonight? Yes. Ladies first. Yeah, I'm, right? yeah, I'm doing well. I'm doing great. It's a That's lovely what's day. Up. That's what's pretty up. Good, so, good. Chilling, chilling. Intr- introduce yourselves. Go what ahead. up? I am I'll Exist, um, aka Ali, aka Lex. <laughs> I am Man Soul, aka Big Soul. So they call me. Come through. So I wanted you guys on today because you got a new single out. Yes, yeah. yes. But all, what sparked all of this was when you did your verses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That that was dope. I'm like, I'm watching, I'm watching you guys and I'm watching you go back and forth and you know, it was it was just so cool, you know. And I'm yeah. like, both of them are super talented. They're you know, skilled with the verses and whatnot. <laughs> thank you. And thank I'm like, you. I'm like, yeah, gotta have them on. Gotta have them on. Yes, you know? yes. Well, thanks for the be on. Appreciate That's that. Sure. And, uh, and, Our and, uh, verses went up that day. Huh? Up. I said the verses went up that day. We we really did. It. <laughs> he really did it hard that day. Yeah, that it was. was real. It was a nice time. It's true. And I'll exist. You have been on the show before when it was audio only. Yes, look so, at you. All I right, love it. I'm I here grew for up it. a little bit. You hey, know? come through, grow up, <laughs> big kid, big right? kid. Yeah. So a lot of lot of things have happened since then. That was last year, sometime. You know. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But um, come through, glow May, up. You, you know, you know. <laughs> <laughs> But main soul, um, I was I was checking out your catalog. Um, mm-hmm. Dope stuff, man. Dope stuff. I appreciate that. I appreciate that, man. Still growing. I was Still um growing. I was checking out thought worth giving. Okay. Okay. And mm-hmm. the two favorite ones on there for me That's were serious. reminisce and universe. Really, I am yeah. so surprised. That really. I've never heard those. Universe is like one of those deep cuts, so I've never heard nobody say that. It's always countdown and blessing. It's always really? mm-hmm. it's always the favorite. So I appreciate you picking those too. I was vibing off of those. This is like, really like a me, like as you can hear, it's a me song, like literally. Yeah. So I appreciate that. That's one of my joints too. I appreciate that. Yeah. Appreciate that. yeah, yeah and yeah. then um solid. I see yeah. that rules. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What's yeah. the chorus on that one? Yeah, hey, yeah. What's this, the chorus on that one? Man, this, like, Stop. I, 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 can't even, I can't even lie to you. Man, like, so many, so many it's so many It's so true. Think, yeah, I really be forgetting how many we have. Like every time me and Lex link, something is coming out of out of it, whether it be just a blueprint, an actual whole joint. Like literally, she was here not too long ago in the studio, and it's just like, man, every time. It's like just working, over back that. Just, That's what that one is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we cross lines like a hashtag. Hey, it's working, with man. all disrespect, I, I think it's time to adjust the rules. No more missing yeah. you. No more missing now. And no more guessing and, and just for cloud. We have so many <laughs> records that it just be like, we forget. Yeah. We write, we write a lot up. together. Yeah, we work a lot together. So how did, how did you all connect? Uh, through a producer uh, that I used to be um, in a group with titled New Soul. His name is Walt Dalla, still one of the hottest out. Um, and so, May, he was actually in a group as well when I met him. And uh, yeah. he he just had crazy hooks. He, had, he always had nice hooks. And so, uh, Walt, he's just the guy that put people together. And uh, yes. me and May met, and it's been, it's been tight knit ever since. Yes, yes. That's what's up. That's what's yeah. up. Yeah, man. And what's crazy about that is one of the joints that um she had jumped on, I didn't even know she hopped on it until I got to the studio. I'm like, who just jumped on my song like this? Who is this? I'm like, I don't I don't know her, but it's fine. Like, yeah. That's, that's 
Lex. Lex. That's that's my 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 teammate right here. I'm like, yeah, you know, we gotta become friends. We have to become friends. And yeah, that's, that's so true. She's been able to get me out of here since then, man, for sure. I like that's so it. And then it was another. It was an oh the pain video. I saw her name yes. hit, hit the screen. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> I think that was uh I was our first like collab, That's the collab. Joint. like yeah that was the yeah. official like where it was just me me and Maine yeah 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 That's first what's session up. really sat in together locked in that was the first one the very first yeah one. that's true wow yeah. Time That's flies. classic right there That's going down in history That's classic That's real life that's that's I real love life. the videos I love the videos and the scenery and everything I, I yeah, love that man. Yeah yeah, like it's, I really, I really try, you know, uh, to do the best I can with uh, being independent, you know, as far as the scenery or making the best of what did I have, what I have. So, um, I be trying, man. So I appreciate you really, like, oh, his videos are maybe a little bit different, you know. I appreciate that. Who appreciate who does that. your video productions? So basically, it's my man Drew, um, Cult Studios. He does most of them. Um, well, I can't say most of them. Actually, all of them after pain. Okay. Um, I lost touch with the guy that did pain. Mm -hmm. Um, but um, anything after pain, uh, Cult Studios. His name is Drew. Tell him okay. to do. He did all my videos. So yeah. That's what's up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's Shout get to, to Drew. This, let's get to this reflection. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Tell me about reflect. How did that come about? So um, instantly, I had me and Lex had deep conversations like this all the time. I'm like, uh, the next project. I do has to be something totally like different. Like it's going to be in the now. So um, normally what end up happens how me and Lex work here at beat. I may send a verse. She sends something crazy back and I'm amazed. So this one, I had just laid a verse. I'm like, Lex, I don't know where I'm going with this. What can we, how can we work it out? We figure something out and we, we got reflections. Yeah, like, it just it just come natural like that, like every time. Whether she seen me, so it wasn't or something, it wasn't like really planned out or anything. It just happens. It just always yeah, happens. Wow. it just happens. happens. You know, Organic. man is a man is a visionary. So, um, I hear something and I I hear I'll hear a melody, I'll hear a rhythm. Like my 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 thought automatically goes towards rhythm. Um, and so I'm thinking about melodies and flows before I put lyrics down. And so Manny hears something and he'd be like, yeah, this about a relationship or this about like he, he, he see he sees the music video. You know what I'm saying? Like when the, when the beat is later, when we like, or we're like vibing out, like he starts seeing like video clips. And so it kind of like, it, it works like that. You know what I'm saying? So I, I do the, the melody of something and then he'll come in, like he'll have like a vision of something. And then we just work around that. Wow. It's like easy, man. It's just so yeah. easy. I tell her all That's the time. a blessing, though, rapper. to to have that talent because every you know it's it, different artists I've talked to. Sometimes it they're they're like struggling to finish something or complete it, or or yeah. it takes them a long time to to put everything together. And then you have some they're like, oh, I wrote that in thirty minutes, you know. <laughs> <laughs> And 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 it's just like it amazes me how how different creatives work, you know. Yeah, and that's part of the reason why I got this podcast going on, you know. Yeah, and it, you guys amaze me, like seriously. I appreciate I that. Appreciate that. Yeah, like that a um, lot. I tell Lex all the time she's my favorite uh, rap friend because like we can literally talk about uh, a plethora of things mm -hmm. and be like, yo, that'd be something fire, like. Mm -hmm. We need to write about something like that. Like we need to write, or like I tell her all the time, her uh, demo track where she's not saying nothing, she's just really just going off rhythm. I'll be like, Bro, yeah, I'll listen just to be that. doing some mumbo, I'll, doing I'll some mumbo, you know. So it just come off so natural, and I appreciate that with Lex. You know, I think she's a big part of uh, growing. She tests me every time she get on a song, or man, you gotta go harder than that. That's not it. I was like, all That's right, what's up. back to the drum board. I go. Yeah, board. yeah. We okay. definitely push each other. We definitely push each other. So, what other um, what other collaborations have you done, man? So, um, I'm very. I have a couple. It's not that many. Um, I'm kind of like, I be in my own bubble type of deal. Um, I've done features for people. Um, like I deal with a lot of producers. Mm -hmm. Um, like overseas, the actual versus okay. when they beat tape or something like that. Actually, I just did my first, uh, I can't say first. 
I could like they all happen at the same time. So like a, like a, it was like three features like in a month. So I, this is my first official feature somewhere that's gonna actually go out soon. So um, Don Polish, uh, my boy Tony Price, and the third one I, f- I forgot the producer's name actually. He's in the UK. Kind of hard to pronounce. So excuse me when you see this. My bad. But, uh, <laughs> Yeah. Oh, my bad. Break star. Break star. Okay. Break star. Nice. So, so with the over with the overseas collaborations and, and the producers, how do you, how do you even get connected to those folks? So, okay. To make the long story short, um, my dad is um, uh, best friends and um, with Jay, late Jay, uh, the late great Jay Dillon and whatnot. So, um, okay. we produced on my dad first album. Grew up together since me high. So, um. All his, um, I want to say, assets or people he's connected with uh, passed on to me, per se. You know, and um, okay. they want, they like doing work with, work with me. So um, that's a lot of how I get my interactions with those people overseas, you know. Um, I get a lot up. of uh, love from people overseas rather than here. But I want both. I want it all. So, mm-hmm. um, you know, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a slow ground. But, yeah, overseas, yeah, I, I really like my goal is going to be a thing. It's going to be a thing. Sure. Okay. For sure. Have you ever worked with anybody overseas? I'll exist. Uh, I love that name. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you. Wait, Take how about before you before you go on, right? How about it, it irritates me when people say Al exists? You know what? And I just I I let people have their way. Uh, I'm like, as long as you know how to spell it. Because uh, you fine. have you have them in parentheses. I do. I, I have it on the I have it on the side, and that's how yeah. I how I explain it to people too. I'm just yeah. like, I will, huh? Conjunction exist. <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah. No, I can't say I've ever um did anything with anybody overseas. Okay. They got me on that one. Okay, <laughs> it's coming. Sure. It's coming Back. for sure. For sure. It's coming for sure. It's coming for sure. So, how did you get started, man? So, I, I hear you say your dad and and yeah. and um and whatnot, but you know, my dad was a whore. So, I and I'm not, you know, I'm just kidding. I don't even. I don't even know. Don't but even know. Uh, <laughs> once again, going back to that. Uh, so, seeing as though um he was an entertainer my whole life, so basically, at, at first, I was ashamed of it. Like, like yo, really? I hate it. Cause it's underground. Like people don't really have a lot of people my age and younger don't have appreciation for underground or boom bap music, whatever you want to call it. Um, at a young age, I was ashamed of it. I'm like, oh my god, please, I hope nobody find out that my dad's a rapper. Da da da. Mm. My homeboy used to clown me. Um, over time, but I always liked it on the low. I just was ashamed to admit it. Um, got older, homeboy starting to rap. I'm like, I want to, but I'm kind of nervous. I want nobody to laugh at me. Get a little older, get in a group with my friends that I grew up with. Um, how would you put it the proper way? Um, just didn't work out like that, like how you wanted it to. Um, mm-hmm. Art don't match really the direction, and I just started on my own and um, just kept going, just kept going. Like after Pain came out, literally after Pain came out, like that project was the most unorganized project I've ever done. <laughs> really? I, like literally, like it was like because I was in such a rush to prove myself, you know, mm-hmm. um, that I could do it. Uh, absolutely to my dad, because I'm like, I don't want your help. I'll do it myself, you know. <laughs> did tell you in a heartbeat, like you did it on your own. You you did you did it. You see what I'm saying? You took what was given to you and did it on your own. You didn't beg me to help you. So I just forced myself, like, yo, you gonna finish what you done started, and I haven't looked back since. So. I um, just got a real appreciation for like the whole underground scene. And I, I feel like it's my mission to um, bring that to the forefront. I'm tired of it being labeled as underground. Nah, it's all music, man. It's, it's yeah, that's true. Forefront. That's true. I, I really don't set it aside as something different. Like, I just yeah. love music. So w- w- give me whatever, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it, it's, I don't even, I don't even, you know, call stuff underground anymore. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. it's like it's a double edged sword for me because sometimes I I um I love that the fact that we to the side because it's like it's like if you know you know things. But sometimes I'll be like, put some respect on these lyricists' names. You see what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Put some respect on a lot of these guys that are really 
rapping something that's an everyday struggle. Don't don't yeah. count them out because a lot of stuff that's in the light isn't true or isn't a real thing. Everybody right. can relate to that. You're yeah. not rich, so why are you screaming it? But that's all the right. discussion. Rapping about hurting unicorns and you don't even know what a unicorn look like in real life. Uh-huh. uh-huh. You know? Um, you know? We don't even they don't even exist. Well, I don't know. But anyway. I would really be ashamed if rapper said I shoot unicorns. I would be okay, bro. You gotta go. You gotta I'd be go. like, I need to see it. Uh right. <laughs> um, I'm interested. Put it on your Insta Snap. Put it on your I'm Insta interested. Uh... <laughs> Insta Snap. <laughs> Unicorns on Insta Snaps. I'm interested. I, I'm there. Uh, let me hear the song. Let me see the video. Right. <laughs> Give me the what vision. What are What are some of your outside influences other than your dad? Uh, kind of got circled back. So, um, Jay Dilla is like almost like that sound is like infectious to me. Like that's something I couldn't get away uh, get away from. But um, by that being easy, if I had to pick like three off the top of my head, uh, you said easy. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> but no, um, Cole is like my number one go to like uh, guy. Um, Kanye West, despite what's going on now, please don't don't talk. I mean, Con- Kanye West is very very talented when it um, comes to hip hop. So yeah, factually, that, that, that's that's. You know the other stuff. Yeah. You know, okay. But I'm glad yeah. you agree on that. But okay. Um, <laughs> and then just just somebody that's new and young that is heard that line like Isaiah Rashad. Hands okay. Down. Isaiah Rashad is one of those guys that I'll be like, yo, I need that verse about you, bro. I need to look so, that up. Yeah, Isaiah Rashad is very, very that that guy. But it's a lot of people because I can get into an R and B bag sometimes. I'm trying to mm-hmm. sing like Lex, man. My we guy R and B wise, I'm trying to get like uh, what's his name, uh, Sir. It's my guy, my number one. Like melodies is like crazy. Can he sing? Yeah. Huh? Yes. Sir. Yeah, he can. Can you? you, gotta you check can, it out, no, man. can you no, sing? You. Oh, me? I only can hold. Yeah. I can't, I can't sing like that. Yeah, he like, can. Like, I speak for him. It's no problem. He lying, yeah. Huh? yeah, he can sing. Ain't that funny? He can sing. People... We got we got records to prove it. Oh. But the, but we it's got not, records to prove it. I don't. <laughs> I'll let Legs do that with me. Just I own heard, it, man. Just it own it. Just say I yes. Hold Just hold own it. Just say yes. Yes. All you gotta pay. do is say yes. <laughs> say yes. Childish, man. Childish. Say yes, dog. Uh, own it. Own it. Real I'm life. on it. Make sure yeah. y'all catch me. I'm gonna be like, I'm definitely singing better than Usher. I'm better than all of these. Yeah, <laughs> just be I'm like, you just got to keep it simple. Just keep it simple. Right, I can you sing. Say, yeah, I can I'm sing. Yes. Yeah. It is I. Yes, I can. Yes, right. I can. Man, keep so. it diplomatic. Yeah. There, there we, we go. go. Main soul is versatile. Main soul, definitely. the singer. Definitely. Definitely. Facts. That's real. Definitely. Can't put me in the box. So, so uh, when, is, when is the um, the collaboration uh, CD coming out of, of Main Soul uh, and I'll Exist? Hey. hey I'll let her okay. answer that because she's a very busy woman. Very it's, busy. So. It's real. It's real deal. Uh, but we are working. Me, as I said, me and Main are in a cut all the time. Uh, we got a lot of records together. And um, yeah, I would I would say soon. I say we we working towards it, and I you know we got that ear. Okay, we got that ear. So uh, on another note, how has and uh, each of you can respond to this one? How has this COVID nineteen affected you? Mm. Mm. You want to go first? Ooh. Um, Personally, uh, we gonna we gonna talk about in different matters. Uh, personally, um, I'm I'm just a person of faith. I I've had a lot of peace in this time, um, peace in the quietness and peace mm. in the chaos. Um, so that's that's something for me. But uh, financially, uh, well, first of all, we we thank God for unemployment <laughs> and that that was able to go through for artists, right? Uh, because other than that, I. I I was going to be out of luck um, as well as, you know, a lot of my, my artist friends who gig primarily, you know, for uh, 
money. Um, that's our that's our main source of income. And so um, I would say I was just speaking to somebody today. Like it's weird, like because the world is opening back up. Like that's crazy to say. Yeah. Um, you know, it's it's weird to 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 be like in in personal close uh, contact with people. Getting used to that again. Like I need to call some people. Um, but it, it definitely took a it. What it did for me is is it opened my eyes to how I need to move um, in this industry. Um, mm-hmm. I, you can't just be you know one lane. Like a lot of my income was coming from gigs, and it's okay. like. Yeah, like I need to get back into writing jingles. I need to get back into writing theme songs. I need to, you know, uh, what it did for me is it, it allowed me to um, see all the talents that I do have and work at those things. And so ultimately I used it for my good. But I, I would say like uh, first uh, it did affect me like just emotionally. I'm a I'm a physical touch and a quality time love language. Right, and, right. Um, yeah, uh, that was definitely missing for me. So I was, your girl was going through for a bit, but came out on top. So, uh, it definitely did me bad. Like the first go around, oh my gosh, like man, it did me bad. Far as like writing ability, I just was yeah. really, really drained. I didn't get no work done until like the end of it, like to recently. Like, really, had a real, real good growth spurt. That's what we was talking about last time we was in the studio together. Um, I didn't really, um, I really couldn't write. And I really couldn't really do much of nothing, really. Um, just being in the house for me, I'm not an in-house person anyways. Mm-hmm. I'm not an outside person either way, in- either. But, you know, um, being able to pick up and go when you want to is the type yeah. person I am. So that's what messed me up. I can't just pick up and go to the mall, to my grandma's house or you no know, whoever house, you know. Um, so musically, it definitely affected the pen. I just tried and tried and tried. I deleted plenty of songs. Um, I just was talking to talk. Uh, yeah. But eventually, when you get used to being in the house and having to stay, that's when I got back into the songwriting mode again and mm-hmm. uh, really getting that feel back again instead of just sitting around and feeling terrible about yourself because you think you're an artist. Well, you know you're an artist and can't really get past that. You can't that really art. Block. Yeah. yeah. You, there's no, <laughs> you haven't life. had any conversations that you can write and speak on. You haven't seen anything. So it's kind of, it was kind of tough for me. And I took it really hard on the chin, you know, emotionally, like seriously, like on the chin, like, oh my God, am I terrible? Like, am I really a rapper? Like, what's up? Like, but eventually when I got used to it over a course of time, I, I got it back though. So it was That's all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I think this is, this, uh, this whole, fiasco has affected a lot of people in many different ways and um you know speaking on the unemployment some people still haven't gotten that yeah i got some friends and i the stimulus check yeah yeah all of that yeah all so that. it's and then yeah. now you got people you know because they just doing whatever they want <laughs> it, it, stuff is starting to get locked up again uh, definitely. Um, yeah. I was telling my um my little sister that like you better enjoy going to the mall while you can because um, <sighs> it's definitely going right back Shut where it back was. Down. It's definitely going down again. Definitely That's going down. That's a mandatory, again. fam. Five hundred dollar fee. Ooh. Protect yourself. Yeah, it's it's wild, and people are people are so on the edge right now. You know. Oh, and they, they're on the edge. I keep hearing all these reports and stuff about people getting into it over over being told to wear a mask. And it's just like, bruh, I what do you overall? I just think us staying in the house mentally has screwed a lot of people up. If you think about yeah, how mm-hmm. social media I has do changed, that. people are just sitting behind keyboards saying anything because they have nothing to do. This is the most yeah. negative I've seen social media is in a long time. Yeah. yeah, in a long time. It's like we're giving so much of the wrong things. Like it is crazy. It is you know so like crazy. We we're sitting in like actual history, you know, and it's like it's not it's not one person who has experienced this quarantine the same. You know, when you're home, you know, I, I'm thankful that I'm in a peaceful living situation, you know, but that's not the case for everybody, you know, and that's just the reality oh of it God. is that yeah. you're, you're stuck with whomever you're stuck with. And, you know, 
um, like we're we're sitting in a time like they're gonna be talking about this like you know History for years books. and years and years. You know what I'm saying? And so it when you when you keep people kind of bottled up like that, um, you know. It, you expect for things to, to, you know, when they start getting back in front of people, like stuff's just going to shake, you know, yeah. um, like we, we as people like need other people, like uh, regardless of you introvert That's or extrovert, fact. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like we thrive off of being around people and being around people we enjoy even the more. Exactly. So if, if you don't have that peace, whether it, like if you were home by yourself for three months you know what i'm saying if you don't have that peace uh with yourself and you don't have that peace with the people you're around like i i expect like you know some some sort of backlash you know some sort of just built up yeah. you know tension you know yeah, yeah. that's it's why I just, I just go outside every day and stand in the front yard and holler you know that's yeah. good. Yeah. Come back in the house. You know, it feels good. You, you, know? you got a specific uh saying that you that you holler? I, a lot of times I go out there and be like, I'm sick of this. I I don't want to be out there here no more. Yeah. 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 And the neighbors be like, shut your ass up and go in the house. And I'll be like, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Yeah, wow. She gonna cry in the car. Wow. She gonna cry in really the car. I really don't do she that. She gonna cry in the car. Listen, uh, uh, it'd be like that. I'm here for it. I'm here for the expression. <laughs> right, All right. it needs to come out. It's been it's been interesting um, with the different performances that people do, you know, virtually, yeah. and you know, I've it participated in that as well. Yeah, and it, it's just it's really different. Like you said, we need to be around people, and you know, watching some smiley faces jump up the screen is not just the not the same thing. It's just like what is happening? I can't hear nobody. You know, I can't hear nobody be like that wasn't funny or you know, uh, <laughs> yeah, that instant reaction. Like yeah, that's that's, that's, that's a that's part a, of the art that's just like not here right now. It's and wild. We here for the applause, like you know what I'm saying. Like that's 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 what it is, and that's the truth of it. It's like you know, you you just see hearts going up the screen, and uh, you know, enough. I love this, and I I feel that that thank you for sending your love through. Right. Also, I really wish I could be around you to feel your your presence and your energy. Yeah. You know, I miss so. that. I miss going to you know see you guys perform. I haven't seen you perform, main soul, but. You know, I, I miss seeing people perform because it's, yeah, it's exciting. Coming. Yeah, it's, it's true. Me too. Me too. I'm going yeah. to all the shows. It's a, that, it's that a show. A it's, I think that it's a, a show. Fact. I can't wait for a concert. That is a fact. I, I think it's a show this Sunday, either this Sunday or next Sunday. or I know it's something coming up with Sound Off Sundays. And uh, I, I believe I believe I it's gonna that. be outside. Come through. And I'm like, man, I need to um I need to do this. I need to go just so I can be, you know, in the mist. I will yeah. wear my mask in the mist. Because we got to. You know, because I, I don't want I don't want snow fine. Nah, I'm not, nah, I'm not, nah. I'm not gonna lie to you. The mask makes me want to stay at home. Yeah, dog. It is annoying. You, know, my, you having my, trouble like, breathing? It, it irks me so bad to walk through Walmart grocery shopping with that mask on. Oh my yeah. god, I'm gonna go crazy. Do and you feel gonna, awkward? Gonna, do, feel do you awkward? feel awkward being a black man with a mask on? No. No. Okay. I, I think, feel I think awkward. People just insecurity thing. Like they like. What do you? Everybody has a mask on. How do you look stupid? Like how do you look stupid? Everyone has one on. That I just have to ask because you know some people have said that they're like I'm a black man. Oh, look, walk around. What does that have to do with you being black though? That has nothing to do with you being a black man. Like, yeah, we have other causes to be worried about, man. Come on, man. I feel awkward like because I still be smiling at people and they like don't they know. Can see me, like I gotta. I'm practicing that, my right? my smizing. You know what I'm saying, like. Like that's hard. You know what I'm saying? Like your whole bottom face is covered. You I, can I, sometimes tell from the eyes. Yeah, sometimes. that's so I've been working hard in my eyes and my and my smizing. 
I really have. I'm like, I'm like, I'm smiling at children. They just look, they just look like I'm staring at them or something. And I could really be doing you, it. You gotta get you a mask with a smile on it. That's what I woo, that look. I'm, I'm gonna try that. Hold up. Hold Don't up. get a creepy Let's, one though. Get get the you know the mild smile. Yeah, a mild smile, mild yeah. brown smile mask. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna that, have to look into Don't that. get the clown one or nothing. That's Oh, no, 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 down no. the aisles and stuff. No, I don't want to scare the children. <laughs> right. Oh no. Oh no. <sighs> oh yeah. So can it. y'all yeah, do y'all freestyle? Maybe freestyling. Uh, what you mean, no, no. <laughs> Oh, you hey, denying oh, the singing, <laughs> you denying the freestyle. Oh! I w- I'm really not even. Pre- I really wouldn't even prepare. See, this is a, a learning lesson right here. Freestyle is, is is off the cuff. I freestyle for fun with the homies in the car. Uh-huh. And, uh, you see what I'm saying? Never, see, you know, yeah. if I knew with that type of time, I would have been like, get get them together. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm on lake type time. You know, like in a. On some goofiness, yeah. Well, that's some goofy stuff. I, yeah. Next time around, I'll come prepare and bar it up. I got it. I promise, promise. promise that's promise. what's up. That's what's up. I just was messing with you, you know. And I, I know. Just, yeah. We ain't on the cipher today. This, 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 this just a, a conversation. Too, I jump in. I'm just not. Don't promise to be good. <laughs> have you all, have you all been in a cipher before? Yes. Uh, what was that like? It's fun when it's with the right people. I know, right? So you've been in a real cipher licks? Yeah. I, well, I grew up with a with a hip hop dad too. So okay, um, okay, okay, okay. you know, like I was always around rap niggas, uh, so to speak. And so I grew up around like just hip hop heads. And so yeah, they always they always ciphering. Um and then, you know, uh did it at school you know just for the fun but then also like you know like actually trying as well um okay. i think it's fun i do i don't mind making a fool out of myself freestyling uh, yeah. it just depends where <laughs> it's true but it's true like in high school when they was going for real i used to be like bro those bars are terrible brother them bro, bars are calm down I would, dog. I, would never jump in, though. I would never jump in i'm like first off i talk extra fast and it's just not your time yet, bro. It's just not your time. It's yet, not bro. your so time. I just sat out. I just sat out. I just sat out. Mm. Waiting for my time to come. Yeah. It's so, fun with the right group of people. That's for sure. Other than getting back to like you know being able to freely move about the cabin, um, what 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 are you really looking forward to um, once the world comes back to some kind of some kind of normalcy? Because I it ain't it ain't never gonna be the same. Um, I'm looking forward to really just oh my gosh, um, perform like I really want to perform this this new this new one. That's like some selfish stuff to say. I think that's really selfish. Yeah, but, um, I'm thinking like really looking forward to performing that. Nice. And, um, just uh, just going back, just being normal, like not have to look over your shoulder or worry about a fine. Just like really just being normal. That's what I, that's all I need. Like normal life. Concerts, the ball, out to eat, like come on. I'm I looking to be I'm looking forward to somebody if they cough or sneeze, and I'm like Ah, just not looking over your shoulder. I'm tired of that. You Being know paranoid. It's, it's like funny yeah. story. Funny story. At the start of this whole corona thing, I didn't take it serious. So really how the how the universe work is on Instagram. And I had seen like some, I think it was like complex or something like that. It is said that um it stays in the air for about one or two minutes. So I dismiss it. I go to Walmart grocery shopping. I don't have a mask. So I'm on my way to check out line. Dude coughs hysterically. He didn't have no mask. On? Everybody, no mask. Just coughs. Ah. Not like this. Just oh, oh, oh. oh. Right? So ah. instantly, so instantly I thought about that video, like, bro, it lingers in the air. I instantly turned around and went the long way around, around the hall. Like, I wasn't playing the game. So ever since then, I was like, I'm taking it serious. Uh, I'm yeah. wearing my mask. I'm, you know, hand sanitizer up. Uh, I'm chilling at the crib. I hate That's it, real. I'm chilling at the crib. So. Honestly, for me, normalcy, I'm looking for traveling, 
the road trips. I want to go to a theme park. Uh, I need an adrenaline kick. Um, I need. I'm looking forward to stuff like that. Uh, outings, um, being around, you know, the friends, and just hanging out without, you know, I don't. I don't think it's gonna be a normalcy though. If I'm, if I'm honest. Yeah. I don't think so. Not, 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 not what I've been seeing and the way things are going. It's like the 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 new normal is this. Yeah, and and that sucks. Definitely. Yeah, uh, I was planning on going to Miami in August. Woo! Thinking and everything. Wow. It's on fire down there, so you know I had to cancel that. Fire. Yeah. It's on it's on sulfur down there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What? Wow. Yeah. Yeah, it's so, real. I'm chilling. Yeah. I'm chilling. It's well, real. I, you you two are super, super talented and you know I, I like I said, that 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 Instagram live you did, <laughs> that was dope. That was like truly dope. We thank you for tuning in. Did, did you yes, all save yes. that? Did we? Nah. I don't even know who I don't even know who Instagram we was on to have saved it. Cause that could have been his history too. That's real. I, yeah, I, 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 I yeah. Yeah, it, yeah. We got we should, always got songs. You gotta do it again. You gotta do it again. That's true. We'll record right. it. Come so prepared. to to the to the individuals watching this, in the description, there's the link tree for Main Soul and also the link tree for I'll Exist. Yes, yes. Turn up, so turn you up, all can con- you can get in contact with them. You can check out YouTube because they they both got YouTube channels. Mm-hmm. They both have music on the streaming platforms. Yes, I mean, yes. y'all y'all doing the thing, and uh, you know, thank you for Seda. <laughs> Hey, that's why I call it the goat. There's no way I'm gonna cap right now. A song every day. Oh my gosh, her her pin game is crazy. Pin game is crazy. That looks crazy this year. So we did we did six days out the week. Six days. Producer range, right? (laughs) It was it was it was challenging, but it was it was definitely worth it. I loved it at the end, like. To know like how challenging it was because of where we're at, um, you know, the pandemic and everything, um, and just pulling from that, like it definitely pulled me and pushed me in different areas. And it honestly, I look back at it like I'm listening to the songs, like every day, like yo, that's crazy. I I forgot I made this. So yeah, it is thank amazing you, to go you. back and hear the things that you created. Yeah, yeah, because I was just, I was just. Working at like a machine, I'm like, oh, you was pumping them out. It. I gotta finish it, and so it, I wasn't even like listening. Like I was listening to it to hear like it's mixed well, da da da. But I wasn't like listening to it. You know what I'm right, saying? I was right. just like, shoot, 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 shoot. <laughs> like, let's get them, let's get them out, let's get them out, let's get them out. And, and right. like, when, I'm, when you're able to look back at like records, you just push it. And you know what I'm saying? Like it's really gratifying to like be like, oh, I actually really like this cut. Yeah, that yeah. was nice. So yeah. Between- between 2019 and the 2020 version, what what did you what did you learn, or what did what what did you do different? Um, I learned to prep myself. Um, like I, this go around, I had like because COVID had already started. I was like, okay, well, let me start working on tracks right now. Mm-hmm. And so um, I learned to like the days that I really wasn't feeling it. Like, I already had, like, a, a scope of an idea of a song pretty much finished. Um, I learned uh, this. So, 2019, I, I learned that I could do it because I didn't. I was just like, hey, uh, throw this out here. Let's see what we're going to do. And <laughs> to learn to know that I could, like, that was. And to know that people were supporting me, like, seeing, you know, uh, watching me and following me through. Um, and I got a lot of followers around that time. Um, so that was really dope, like, to see people support and just to know that I could. Like, I didn't know that I could. And so this time, this time around was more about, like, persevering and folk, then, like, being in focus and being determined and being, like, uh, you know, diligent to, to, to a task, even when you don't want to. You don't want to show up. You don't want to work. You don't want to be creative. Like, what does your work sound like when you 
when you feel like you're out, you know what I'm saying? Or when you feel like, you know, you just don't want to. And it's like, I, I do, I do this, you know, I do music for a living. So it's like, it comes in times when I'm inspired and when I'm creative, but there's a time when, when you're not inspired and when you're not creative and are you still able to put out, you know, your best work, um, you know, Ooh. or good work, quality work. Are you still, you know, able to, to, to put together like content. And so this time I just learned that like beyond me being like being able to, like I'm, I'm actually capable and I'm at, uh, of putting out efficient um, material. Um, I may, I'm able to work in this field. And I think like, I, I knew I could work in this field, but like, even on, even on bad days, which was a lot uh, during this say that like, I'm able to still work. Um, and that you know, blessed my whole soul. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what's up. So main soul, yes, do, yes. You, do you do any particular type of prep? when you're about to create or or do you it, or do you just go into it so i'm kind of weird with my so basically uh ironically i'm more of a uh, that's why it was so hard for me during uh this whole covid thing i need conversation i need like it could be a word you said like okay i work for quick loans now prime examples um someone could say a word i've never heard and I can think of a rhyme scheme out of nowhere, and I and I know I got beats just sitting here, and I do wow. it that way. Or we could be we could be talking at work or at Walmart at the mall, and have a conversation about something. I can take that and run with it. Or sometimes I might want to th- write something about myself mm-hmm. and get it out here. So I take all aspects of life in, into music and put it into words, for sure. That's what's up. For sure, for sure, for sure. For sure. They still be feeding y'all to death at quick and loans. What do you what do you mean feeding us to death? Like, Man, you, I, I, I was that. there, I was there back some years ago yeah. at, uh, through a temp agency. Okay. And it was just food all the damn time. Oh, I'm like, oh, what yeah, is yeah, happening? Thing, yeah. I'm thinking you, I'm like, I'm like, what you mean? They feed yeah, it's it's always an event with food. It's always Quick and Loans is a dope, um, snacks. a dope uh, company. Ah, snacks on deck. Yeah, for sure. For Man, sure. they put me up out of there. <laughs> uh, ah. It was like, get out! You too silly up in here. Really? Because no, it's a lot of silly. I don't no, be hard, no. Quick and Loans, Quick and Loans is the silly capital of Detroit. They, they do some outlandish stuff before before you shift and everything. But it was um I think the reason why I was let go was because they were trying to get some numbers up and they hired a whole bunch of people. Mm-hmm. And then once that happened, you know, they started letting people go. And that yeah. I think it's a cycle they go through every once in a while, but okay. It is what it is. You know, I was there before. <laughs> well, I, I, I definitely had to get used to the atmosphere, or as that as the company would say, the culture, how yeah. like, interactive people are. Because I'm very, they're I very interactive. I'm very of an introvert type person. Like, I'm very to myself if I don't really know you like that. So I had to get used to mingling with everybody, and everybody wants yeah. to know your name type ordeal. I had to hide yeah. that issue many a times. Like, bro, like, kind of close. Before COVID, like, he was bro, already bro. he was already putting the COVID on him. Like, give me six <laughs> feet, bro. Give yeah, me fifty I, feet. <laughs> I believe in my space, man. I believe in my yeah. space. I respect everybody. You see what I'm saying? I'll talk. But it's like when it's time to be quiet, it's time to be quiet, bro. I'm here for work. That's like that's how I was raised. Like when it's time to work, it's time to work. Like, right? That's just what it is. Like even in the studio, me and Lex. Okay, our conversation is good. Lex is mixing vocals. I'm not on her shoulder. Hey, Lex, how that sound? How that sound? She's working. <laughs> I'm in the back. Do what I'm doing in the cut, smoke a hookah, whatever the case may be, vice versa. So it's like when it's time to work, it's time to work. You know, like yeah. cut all yeah. the foolery out, man. It's time to work. That's what's up. Yeah. So what other what other talents do you guys have that you don't always display? Uh, like any any instruments or you know? Uh yeah, I'm learning. I do a lot. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Well, yeah, I, I I do play instruments. I do play a little bit of keyboard um, and uh, the flute still. Um, oh, really? I didn't, yeah. see, I didn't know about the flute. 
Nah, nah, that's a that's a uh, to the back to the you know. Go get your uh, food. Go on there and get it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, uh, I'm getting into acting. That's super definitely. fun. She's um, definitely an actor. Definitely. definitely. Oh, that was so actor. fun. Do reflection, dog. Um, yeah, uh, getting into acting, and um, you know, uh, everything that that has to do anything with music or arts, like poetry, has always been a thing for me. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, uh, creating creating anything um, is really fun. Um, doing a project right now where I'm coming up with the visuals, so things for film, um, okay. things for uh, creating visuals for like books. And things like that. Mm-hmm. I just like I like imagery, and I like uh, taking pictures and uh, doing like some some filming too. So I'm learning. I'm pretty I'm pretty good at that too. Um, What's up? We out here in these streets. Yeah. Well, actually, before a rapper, I thought I was gonna be a chef. Uh, really? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Look that, was, that was my, that was my first. Something. That was my first uh, first passion type ordeal. Really? I went to AI. Uh, Art Institute of Michigan. Uh huh. Um, so yeah, I still get it in, but music is primary now. Like I still get it in, but yeah. so low key, I could I can go out and get a professional chef job if I wanted to type of deal. So high key, oh, oh man, key, that high key. Oh. <laughs> Real life. That's oh. really bad. That's what's up. I do need to say this though. In the reflection video, at the end when y'all was throwing the popcorn. <laughs> Like, dog, I was looking at that popcorn like, damn, that popcorn looks good. <laughs> and then y'all started hey, that's, throwing that's it. I'm like, no. Of, of food. That's Lex's idea. She wanted to waste it food. It sure that's was. I was like, yo, yeah, we going to throw popcorn at each other. <laughs> Let's do it. I was excited for it. I really wow. was. Wow. It was all buttery looking. I'm like, man. <laughs> I hey, now I got to go movies. back and see if it's actually buttery, though. Now I got to go back and nah, see if it's buttery. That popcorn though. is everywhere. That thing was hilarious. <laughs> That's that was one of my faves. Y'all that was like my... you had a lot of fun in that video. That that scene and the uh, scene where I'm cussing you out is my fave, dog. <laughs> it's my absolute fave. That's why I say she needs to be active because she really snapped. Like a month before it happened, I'm like, you about to turn I'm about to turn to Denzel Washington. I'm thinking I'm about to take her serious. I just couldn't do it at I'm like, bro, Lex, bro. Cause I was such a we as we soon as she off, said this is what the scene is, she snapped into that role. I'm like, yo, she's serious. She about to smack me for real. Like, bro, oh. like, <laughs> like for real. She was serious. I'm like, oh man. All right, bet. All right, bro. That's hilarious, dog. I loved it so much. Yes. I love yes. you so yes. much. Yes. Well, yes. keep up the good work. Keep it up. Thank, thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Don't... You too. Thank yes. you. We appreciate you. I appreciate yes. you yes. every day. I really thank do. you. I appreciate you because uh I got theme songs and <laughs> Listen, we both out here shining, 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 shining. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Right. Got to do that. Got to do that. And, um, you know, I, I be telling people all the time, like, yo, you need that done. You better contact. I'll exist. I know. She I appreciate do you it. so much. Man. I appreciate you so much. I, got, I had some people slide in like, hey, yo, Leah suggested you. And I, I thank you so much. I love you so much. You yeah. are really one of my biggest supporters. And um, you are I support super- everything that you do. Everything that you do. Thank you. You super freaking talented, though. <laughs> I really appreciate that. And you do a great job at what you do. Definitely. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, you 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 are very creative. And I know, you know, from seeing you two together, the both of you are super creative and, and just keep up yeah. what you're doing. And um tell the people watching how they can get in touch with you and you know, if you have any hey, specific first. services that you that you're available for, let them know. Nice. Uh, you can find me uh, Instagram at a l underscore e x i s t or Facebook at I'll exist. Um, yeah, if you need theme songs, if you need jingles, if you need uh, uh, lyric videos, if you need uh, literally anything that has to do with arts and music or production mixing, I do it all. I'm gonna be shooting that out soon, um, marketing and stuff like that. 
Um, so be on the lookout for that. Uh, yeah. That's why she's the GOAT, man. But you can reach me uh, Facebook. Uh, I'm talking about Facebook. Instagram at Main Soul Official. Uh, Twitter, Main, uh, Main underscore Soul. I'm always there. Tap in uh, guest versus for sure. And then, you know, all major platforms. Just type in Main Soul. Go look at all of the projects. And that's Main that Soul with an E after it. Yes, e it's in it. Yes, sir. So, S-O-U-L. So, Go and give reflections. You know, uh, you never know. Something may be coming in July. Uh, hey. I, I, I don't. Uh, like in July, something might be coming. I don't know. I, I don't hey, know. I'll be looking. I don't know. But, you know, definitely on those platforms, Instagram, Twitter, and uh, Spotify, iTunes, you know, Amazon Prime, all of that. Yep, YouTube. And, and also. YouTube as well. Also remember both of their links to their link tree, which will get you everywhere. It's right in the description. Factoid, factoid. That's what's up. Well, I appreciate y'all for coming on. Thank you for having us. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You're very, very welcome. Be right back. It was so great to have your eyes watching. To advertise here, please send inquiries to info at experience.com. With Lily. That's what's up.